Here's a quick news update in a minute for Trinidad and Tobago. Reggae veterans unite to address Trinidad's crime wave in powerful new single, The Call. Artists include Marvin King, Izasha, Ziggy Ranking, King David, and Prophet Benjamin as they speak out against rising violence. Trisha Villaruel, the mother of Amara Lalit, the four-year-old tragically beheaded, passionately expressed that death would be too lenient a punishment for the perpetrator, wishing instead for enduring suffering akin to her daughter's ordeal. She revealed details of her relationship with the suspect, noting his protective nature towards Amara until his recent erratic behavior, culminating in the horrific incident. Meanwhile, Amara Lalit's father expressed anguish and blamed the system's failure to grant him custody for her tragic death, stating he had tried relentlessly to see her but was met with obstacles. Take a sip of Caribbean Spring Naturally Alkaline Mineral Water fresh from the Northern Range in Trinidad. Authorities seized 43 animals after intercepting a group unloading them from a vessel. The Ministry of Agriculture, Land and Fisheries detailed the incident where officials discovered the animals in a cart being pulled ashore by a tractor. The individuals involved fled upon seeing the officers, leaving the animals behind. Minister Randall Mitchell announced the revival of the International Soka Monarch ISS competition at the Tuco award ceremony, seeking partners for a renewed event in 2025. The last ISM was in 2021, won by Pharma Nappy virtually due to COVID-19 restrictions. Lack of funding led to its discontinuation. We give quick news updates every day, so follow us for more.